So let us see this garbage that is produced at each and every house that is dumped in the outskirts of cities. So this garbage is accumulated like piles, heaps, just like mountains. But how many days we do that? Every day, tons and tons of waste is generated in the cities. It is dumped at some place. But is it a permanent solution? How it is going to affect the environment? So it is not the permanent solution of just dumping the waste at one particular point. There should be proper management of waste disposal. Waste can be segregated into degradable, non-biodegradable. Non-biodegradable waste also, some certain part of it can be recycled. So recycling has to be done. Recycling has to be done. First grading has to be done. Grading. In certain cases, in some places, the grading is done primarily at the point of source. Where is that source point? Homes. Domestic. In the house itself, you can put the degradable waste in one bin, non-biodegradable waste in another bin. So by that, the non-biodegradable waste, it can be sent for recycling. The biodegradable waste, it can be dumped. So by that, it will be degraded. If it is done in a proper way, the effect of the waste will be less. Otherwise, it leads to so many dangerous problems. And after a long period, rectification is not possible. Even though the government spends thousands and thousands of crores of rupees, it is not possible. Today we see in the newspapers, the government has spent this many crores in purifying the water in Hussein Sagar. We see that the government has got a plan with this many thousands of crores to purify river Ganga. So why, why we are spending this many thousands of crores in purifying after polluting it? Why we are not ever at that point where we should not pollute it? So nobody is aware of that. So nobody is interested in doing that. Of course, the people are aware, if we do so, the water will be polluted, but they, they don't have any interest. They don't have any benefit in doing so. So see, even now, by spending hundreds or thousands of crores of rupees, if it is a manual work, you cannot completely purify a water body. It will take years and years of time, crores and crores of uh, rupees of investment. You could use the money for some other purposes, welfare of the people. So, everybody must be having a sense about the environment so that intentionally we should not disturb the environment because the rectification process is a very, dif very difficult, time taking, long run, may be successful, may not be successful, but its effects will be very dangerous if once such kind of consequences arise, it will be very painful to the mankind, to the people, those who are living in the environment. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up. Please subscribe to our channel to get more videos on CBSE syllabus.